next major step in the going primal model is around measurement. How do we hold ourselves accountable? And the thing about it is sometimes when I say accountable to all of you, you're going to think, oh, that's, I don't really want to hold myself accountable. Accountable is not a bad word. Think of it a different way. This is about keeping score. This is about making it a contest, a competition. So you've identified your passion and purpose. You now have the roles and relationships that are most important. You now know the areas that you're going to maintain attention and intention with what you're doing. How do you know whether you're winning? A different way of looking at this. How many of you would go watch a game of any kind, whatever your favorite sport is, football, basketball, soccer, and they just didn't keep score? It's the same for us, right? We have to know that we're winning. So what I strongly suggest is a scoreboard where you set up metrics that are aligned with your most important priorities and how do you continue moving the ball down the field? So I'll give you an example. I actually put a commitment out on this channel that when I started this, that I will be posting one video a week minimum for the next year. I didn't do that because it's fun. I did that because I now know I'm committing myself regardless if I don't feel good, if I got other things going on, somehow, some way this is gonna happen. What is that for you? You then look to leverage other resources like mentors, mentors that could help hold you accountable. Public commitments, how are they going to hold yourself accountable? This whole issue of measurement can't be underrated. How do you have a weekly cadence to hold yourself accountable? In other words, is this quickly a quick meeting where you can say, what were my last week's commitments? What were the results? And then what are my one or two things in each of these areas next week? And doing that every week can absolutely help move the ball down the field. For me, I actually do it on Sunday evenings of every week. And it's something I strongly encourage you that can really help you.